relationships with people are phenomenal. I've met people all over the world, you yeah. know, through this opportunity. Yeah, that sounds like a great thing. Um, well, I, you were a little surprised when you saw me tonight. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I'm amazed, and I don't know, you know, if there's, I mean, how long has HCG been around, number one, and do, have, do, have they done studies on since how it affects? Since the early 50s, really? uh, right? Miss HCG, mm -hmm. girl? Yeah, since, since 1954, I think it is. Yeah. And the guy, the doctor who developed it, he was actually in India studying little boys that had precocious puberty, and he was injecting them to to like help them get um, either stop their puberty or start their puberty. And when they would come back to him, these little fat boys were coming back skinny. And it really started a snowball effect with him studying weight loss. Okay. So. And, and I think it wasn't until that um, guy from the, the Desbos uh, commercials, uh, the, the Go guy, what's his name? Oh, I can't think of his name. He wrote the book. Um, you know who I'm talking about? Trudeau, um, Kevin Trudeau. Kevin, right. They love cure. Right. He kind of like stumbled across it, I believe, and then he just put oh, that okay. into one of his things. Yeah, that's what I think happened. Are there any long-term side effects, that positive oh. or negative? Well, so they, he does have disclaimers. Uh, Dr. Simeon, who wrote Pounds and Inches, is the book, and people can Google that and look right. up the PDF file for free online. And... Um, he, uh, it's only 40 pages long, the book, and uh, basically, you know, he has some disclaimers in there about certain health conditions and what you should do and shouldn't do, but I always tell people to go get checked out by That's your right. medical professional, whether it be a doctor, or a naturopath, whoever, before you start any kind of diet. Yeah, know? absolutely. Or even exercise program, same yeah. thing. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, more people, and I see this regularly, they'll go into, like, weight loss surgery faster than they will about doing a diet like this. And this has been the easiest thing by far that I've ever done. When you can average a half a pound to a pound a day for a woman and one pound to two pounds a day for a man, there's nothing else like it on the planet. Yeah, yeah it's so, pretty amazing. Yeah. Oh. Okay, well, thank you very much for the call. Thank uh, you. So, uh, okay. now, you know what? I, I think I'm getting camera shy here. Can we have the correct spelling of your, <laughs> your YouTube name? Because I'm thinking MS, and I'm no, no, it's M-I-S-S. -S. It's MS. It is MS, okay. Uh, the second, I was right. Girl. Right. Uh -huh. MSHCG girl, yep. And okay. you'll see so tons much. of videos. Uh, thank thank you so call. much for calling. All Take right, care. Bye. bye bye. Take care. How do we hang up here? Okay. Um, Francisco, can you just tilt down the main camera? Okay. The other thing uh, is that um, I, a year ago this month, got diagnosed by a naturopath. Uh, I had blood work done because everybody knows if they've watched the show before, I had a lot of medical issues. Well, yeah. We found the root of the evil. It's called Lyme disease. Oh, jeez. Okay. And what happened was. It dawned on me that back in 1999, I did get bit. I went to a doctor, took blood work, said, you're fine. And I had the bullseye. Went back to him two weeks later. He didn't tell me that the levels went up. Do you have another phone call? Okay. Hi, you're on the uh, show. Hello, this is Angie, Kitsy Poo 777. Kitsy Poo, Angie, uh -huh. how you doing? Hey. I'm fine. I thought I'd surprise you by calling in. You sure did. And she's been a caller from before. Very nice friend of mine, and she lives in Maryland. 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 <laughs> now you're watching us on the internet. Mm-hmm. Oh, great. Oh, uh, she's yeah. she's so wonderful, and uh, you know, I, I'm just so happy that you called because I put it out there, and I uh, was hoping some people would call. Uh, her, it's cutesy poo. Well, can you, I don't know if you can see it up on your computer. We've got the name. I it might be done it, wrong. It, it, yeah, it's a little, it's kind of hard for me to, to oh, say oh, I'm so, can you, can you spell it out for us? I want to make sure. It's C-U-T. C-U-T. E-Y-P-O-O-777. Okay, you want to do it one more time? It's C-U-T. S-E-Y. S-E-Y. Mm-hmm. P-O-O. Triple seven. Triple seven. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Oh, I'm just like so glad. So have you been watching the show from the beginning? 
Uh, yeah, um, it was a little hard for me to interpret it, though, because um, you know, there was a lot of um, visual activity there, and right. of course that's a weakness, but, but anyway, yeah, but um, I've um, so far I've enjoyed hearing about your success and having lost 50 pounds. Congratulations. Thank you so very much, Angie, mm -hmm. and, uh, you know. I'm, one, I'm sorry, go ahead. No, you go ahead, I'm sorry. I just wanted to know if you know if it would um, if you have to be you know if you have to be a certain you know uh, no, a number of pounds over one's recommended weight to um, to obtain such a prescription because I I know I'm <laughs> I'm no skinny cow I tell you that no as far as I know no you know I've seen I've seen people that just wanted to lose 15 20 pounds that actually went on the diet for like 23 days or 30 days and uh, they achieved it one round and and that was it. But, um, you know, it's a very popular diet. And uh, again, Miss HCG girl, um, you know, she's, she's lost 90 pounds, looks fantastic. And, uh, you know, what I like about it is that she does do these videos so you know what to eat. Because, again, when you're on what they call P2, that's when you're actually taking the, the hormone. And you can take the homeopathic form, but you're eating 500 calories a day. And they come up with all these... And you're not hungry because the, the, uh, the drops or the injections suppress your appetite. And, uh, but they make, they make 500 calories a day amazing with the different recipes they do. And like I said, there's some great videos out there. Awesome. Miss HCG, I call her, you know, the Miss H, you know, like the HCG goddess. Just like I've always referred to you as the YouTube angel, you know. So I got names for different people. <laughs> Uh, thank you, Angie. I really appreciate you um, watching the show and calling in. Oh, and, thank uh, you. I love you. Okay, thank you. I love you, too. Take care. Bye-bye. Right, bye-bye. Take care. Bye-bye. Just hang up here? Yeah, just hit the speaker. Yeah, I forgot. I, you know, I, have, I, I just came up with a great idea as we were sitting there. Since they have YouTube channels, why don't we take a look at one of the videos? We have another call. Okay, well, let's take a call first. Okay. <laughs> hey, welcome to a show. Hi, my name is... Uh, Bernie, I'm from Switzerland. Oh my God, Bernie! <laughs> it's like one something almost quarter to two in the Old morning. Home week, Harry. Oh my God, Bernie! Hi, Bernie. I'm watching you uh, live on the internet right now. Yes, yes, yes. Well, welcome. Oh, tell them about the Google. Thank you for staying up so late. Thank you for the show. It's, it's quite interesting. Mary Angel, I did have a question. Okay. <laughs> it was about uh, uh, well the, about the weight loss. I've been following you actually from from the beginning. Right. <laughs> and I was wondering, like, let's say somebody wants to go on a mild diet, so to say, not not lose a lot of weight. Is HCG still a uh, recommended uh, method? Yes, you, you can. The only thing is uh, they do want you to stay on it usually for a minimum of 23 days. Uh, so even if you, you know, wanted to lose 10 pounds, okay, uh, they would still recommend, um, you know, maybe like 23 days. But uh, it's amazing because your body gets to know when enough is enough because uh, you have these uh, points and, you know, like your body will say, no, that's enough. So you wouldn't have a problem. It's not going to make you, you know, in, into bones. You know what I'm saying? Your yeah, body's going to yeah, know yeah. when it's enough. And, uh, you know, I'm sure you know that uh, there's people all over, not just the United States, but, you know, in Australia and England and all over that are on this, you know, HCG diet. Okay, so thank you very much. Bernie, I, what was the name of that university? I watched your vid. I was that telling is the EPFL. It's called so. It's uh, it's the Ecole Polytechnique Fédérale de Lausanne. Okay, and that's the equivalent to MIT here in Massachusetts. Kind of, yeah, yeah. Kind it's of, pretty right. close to that. It's kind of fun watching you, actually. I must say, it's, <laughs> if we had a bit of a delay right now, uh, right. I've turned down the sound so that I don't get Can any you tell feedback. Them about the other thing? But this is a very interesting sure. show. I've watched the first part. Of course, I'm in the <clears throat> middle of the night here. It's oh, I know, two. quarter to two. But John wants to tell you something for a minute, okay? Well, we do uh, on this show. We do have a video chat available. Um, on Google Chat, it's called. I tried, but I wasn't able to connect for whatever reason. Oh, uh, okay. That's why I'm on the phone. Uh, what is your What is your YouTube name? Uh, Dago Cleo, D A G O C L E O. Okay, I'm going to go to your channel and maybe we'll play one of your videos uh, <laughs> before the show, so you can see yourself watching yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I look at my.
myself all the time. <laughs> oh, and, and Casparella loves Bernie. She just loves Bernie. Okay, so thanks a lot for the show. Thanks for calling I in. I really wanted to say hello to Mary Angel. She's a great lady. Okay. Thank okay, you so much. So, Take care, well, I'll say goodbye then. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye bye. to all of you. Take care. Bye-bye, Bernie. Oh, yeah, there he is. There's Bernie. <laughs> there he is, Bernie. Um, so this, this, this is one of your YouTube friends? Right, and I have to tell you something about Bernie. Uh, Bernie is, I mean, I think they threw away the mode when they made him. This particular gentleman does all these great videos. Yes, in fact, because of him, there's a woman that I do called Mina Angelina. Uh -huh. and she always has pasta in her hair. She's hysterical. But he does such great videos. He cares about people really truly cares about people in such a great way i mean there's there's um oh i love the cowboy one casparella goes crazy for him i mean he's he's really a sweetheart he really is and and i'll tell you something um what i was saying <laughs> santa's workshop <laughs> santa yeah he's he's just phenomenal with everything he does and he he too he has a lot of subscribers Everybody knows him. Everybody loves him. And his wife, Mrs. D.C., she is such a sweetheart. I mean, they take you all over Switzerland, showing you all these great places. Um, it's like it's never-ending. This know? is another it's neat thing about YouTube. I've heard about people connecting, transcontinental connections, where somebody will go to a foreign country and visit their friends from YouTube and be put up and, and well, develop actually, these relationships. Well, actually, Bernie has a friend who, uh, you know, went to Switzerland this summer and stayed with them. And last summer, I had my friend from Germany come to New York and we spent wow, the day together. that's great. So, I mean, this really, it's amazing, um, you know. And then you see the transportation system in Switzerland. He gives us so much. I mean, I cannot... That's um, great. Why don't, say enough about him. If That's you, his dog, Dago. If you um, don't mind, I know you have a couple other things to talk about, and we're running out of time. What I'll do is I'll load some of the other videos from the previous callers, mm -hmm. and you can talk about uh, whatever you want about the uh, that uh, crane, the paper well, crane. Well, I'd like to mention this, but I also would like to talk to you about the Lyme disease thing. Okay. Um, one thing is I happened to go to the library across the street tonight, and at 7.30, uh, they were finishing, so I'm not going to tell you what's going on but basic, about that tonight. But they are doing a reach out to Japan, and what they're doing is they're making baby cranes, uh, paper cranes. And for every paper crane, we have another phone call. No, it's not on our Oh, line. no, okay. For every paper crane that gets made, uh, $2 is being donated um, from this organization called Bezos Family Foundation. And uh, what's happening is um, they are giving the money to the architect for humanity for reconstruction for Japan. So uh, tomorrow, the North End branch on Madison Avenue from 12 to 8, they're going to be making cranes. Oh, there's Miss HCG girl. <laughs> and then Thursday from 1 uh, to 4.30, which is tomorrow, at the Old Mill Green uh, on Boston Avenue and East Main Street, uh, they're going to be doing um, the same thing there. So if you have time, uh, definitely go there, help Japan out, make these. I couldn't do it. <laughs> I can't make those little things, but the paper cranes. And for every one you make, $2 is going to be donated. So it's a very important thing. Again, I don't know what we're looking at at uh, time, but I do have Lyme disease. And um, there is a fantastic video called Under Our Skin. It's out there. Uh, didn't get to talk, and I did want to mention Fractual Time um, by Greg, B-R-A-D-E-N. It's with two Gs. Um, he talks about 2012, which was I was hoping to talk about, but it, it's a phenomenal book. Um, maybe, you know, I could talk about the contents of this, about 2012, because it's not the end of the world, but it is the end of a cycle, 5,125 years, okay? Every 5,125 years, we go through this cycle. And 2012, December 21st, is the end of that cycle. We're going to be going into a new one. He talks about patterns. He talks about um, so many different things. I have become an avid fan of him, and I can't think of anybody out there that 
I look up to more. Is that us or is that somebody else? That is. Okay, it's us. Hey, welcome to our show. Hello? Yes. Hi. Yes. I'd like to talk to Mary, please. Yes, Mr. she's here. Mr. Is, hey. is this Mr. Simbadaros? Mary? Yes, Kalinikta. How are you? Good, how are you? Hey, long time, Missy. It's been a long time, Mr. Simbadaros. Yeah, listen, by the way. Mary? Yes. By the way, have a good one. And Mary, one too. Oh, I, I couldn't hear you. Mr. Simadaris? I hear that uh, you celebrating your birthday today. No, I celebrated it on the 20th. I hit the big 6 0. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the happy big 60. Birthday. Thank you. On March 20th, it was. Okay, anyway, happy birthday. Thank I'm you. Glad to see you again. Thank you. Keep it up. You're doing a great job. Thank you, Mr. Simadaris. We'll talk again. Okay, take care. Yeah, congratulations. Okay, Kali Thank you Nick for the Duff. call, sir. Okay, have a good day. <laughs> bye bye. That's the button, right? Okay, we have five minutes left. Five minutes to talk about. <laughs> you know me, I can't. Yeah. Did you want to say more about the Lyme disease? Because it's, yes. I know so many people okay. with Lyme disease Lyme now. Lyme disease, it's amazing because I found out this has been the root of um, a lot of my problems. Yes, I suffered migraines, but they were being as exacerbated because of the Lyme disease. My joint pain, despite the fact everything that's going on, exacerbated, okay? And, you know, I can't take any type of pain medicine, so I use a, ten un a TENS unit, which is supposed to leave on your back 20 minutes. I burnt my back so severely. I was actually at a dermatologist today, and he goes, you certainly did a hell of a job, you know, I'm burning your back. But that's the only thing that I really can do. And um, right now I'm not seeing a doctor. I was seeing a doctor, but there's a situation going on right here in Connecticut where um, doctors who do treat chronic Lyme disease, okay, uh, seems like some insurance companies go after them. So what happens is a lot of doctors who will treat Lyme disease um, will not deal with insurance companies, and their fees to go and see a doctor can be anywhere from $250 to $1,000. Yeah. Okay, and you know this yourself. Yep. So um, it makes it difficult uh, for people who do have Lyme disease, where are they going to go and get help? Um, it's just amazing uh, what is going on, uh, and it's about time that more and more people start becoming aware of it because it is one of the fastest growing diseases. It's at epidemic levels. Uh, they believe it can be trans uh, transferred just like with AIDS, you know, uh, through sexual relations, through, um, you know, any fluid transfer. So this is very important, too, uh, for people who donate blood. Okay, so there's, there's a lot to be said about it. Uh, things like the HCG, things like fractal time in 2012, things like Lyme disease, I think warrant, you know, the whole topic of conversation. Again, I'm doing one of my accordion things tonight, <laughs> scramming everything in, but... Um, you know me, I love to talk. <laughs> well, we're going to have to have you back to talk more because uh, obviously uh, there's an audience out there. <laughs> yeah, I, I have some great friends that are on YouTube, and yeah. I think the world of them. And to stay up till almost 2 o'clock in the morning to call in, Yeah. thank you so much, Bernie. <laughs> well, remember some it. of the shows that you did uh, when you were here, oh. um, you know, a couple years ago. And the f I remember when we first started our Internet streaming, that your show was the first one to get. We had actually 100 simultaneous users, and which is I phenomenal. I wasn't even aware of that. Because you know. I know there were viewers from California to Canada. That I know. So I'm getting the sign here. So I guess, oh, we're off. We're off the air. Wow. <laughs> wow.